Um, hi, how are you doing, Capricorn? This is your daily reading for June 27th. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I hope you're having a, a really beautiful day. Obviously, I, I already get the vibes of Three of Pentacles, Four of Wands. You're setting up a foundation for yourself. You're feeling some sense of victory in a situation. It might be something you have been working on. It might have been something you might have been really, really, really working on and you're putting it to rest. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 shit. One card. Okay. Why is the judgment in reverse? Why is the judgment in reverse? Okay. are you doing Capricorn uh, I'm gonna be starting to do daily readings well, every fucking day but personal readings I'm gonna start doing them after tomorrow so really that's why I'm fucking hype everything is just coming into place everything is coming into completion and you might have sensed that already you might have sensed like oh man something I've been working on something I've been really working for something I've been really putting in effort what? it's coming to life yeah yeah, it's coming to life and it's, it's bringing this um, this energy of um, something wasn't put to death, something wasn't put to rest. Rather, something was put on the side, you know. You had to focus on something. With the uh, Eight of Pentacles, you had to focus on uh, a really big deal, I would say. Destiny was calling you to do something. Destiny was calling you to just ignore everything else that's happening around you and just really focus on crafting your craft, crafting your pentacle. And uh, with the seven of uh, swords, I really get this energy. You've been gathering up your armor. You've been walking overnight, you know. You've been uh, really gathering up your swords, ready for battle. You've been really being a bit of um, a Capricorn, I would say. Just walking, walking, thinking, maybe overthinking sometimes. But you've been really, really going at it. And with these two cards, I really get the energy. It's like seven of seven of souls to the eight of pentacles seven is like you've been working on your emotions emotional side you know you've been feeling some type of way uh in terms of uh, it might have been a situation that been bothering you a situation where you have to be defensive uh there is that coming to down you know there there is um you need to let go let go of something you're holding on let go of you walking be in the present moment because the two, the three cards I get, you know, even though I have all these other cards, the three cards I get for you today is the full three of pentacles and the knight of cups. New beginnings, new experiences, just feeling that your work is paying off and you're like, you can fully play. Playing mode, you know, yes, justice is coming to your side. You might have been in, you might have been in a situation where it was injustice. You might have been in a situation where it was... Um, a bit complicated, I would say. You, you don't know what side of the scales you're tipping on. You might have been dealing with a Libra. There's this energy of love and uh, happiness and uh, showing off your work. Something you've been working on. Something you've been digging your head through. It's like, man, I can finally show this shit off. I can finally, I can finally show this off, you know. I'm not going to tell you if this is a competition, if this is a, a, a tournament, something you show you, you, you are participating in. I can't tell you how it's gonna turn out, you know. I cannot tell you how something is gonna turn out. But you get this sense of victory already, you know. I feel like you feel it too, you know. You feel this sense of, I can't wait, you know. I've been walking, yeah, you might be having this fear in your heart like, man, I don't even know how it's gonna turn out, you know. But Capricorns, we don't panic. We don't fucking stress. We don't, you shitting me. You got the death card and the judgment in reverse. Both these cards are in reverse. The death card and the judgment in reverse. Something you probably expecting it to die. Something you expect it to just... It, it died. It faded away. It's like maybe a connection with somebody is no longer working out. Think again. That shit's coming back to life. If you were thinking... Um, if you were thinking like... Uh, there is a rebirth in a situation. New beginnings. It's like hold up. Hold your gears, you know, just go at it, you know, just push at it because this is the best we can get. This is the best we can get out of the situation coming through. We've been going through this energy of feeling heavy burdened, feeling like we have to release ourselves, feeling like we have to keep to ourselves. Yes, we might be craving some emotional connections, but we are like, I need to stick to myself. 
and now now the justice is on our side we can let go we can let loose for a bit you know we can actually start to feel love with the night of cups go out seek love go out and just be playful be so joyous because you glow in this energy this within you you feel like you yellow you know within you feel happy within you you feel like emotions are not even bothering you just want to play around fool around just be a fucking fool you know what i mean like oh man that boy is a fool yes cancer and the I'm trying to be respectful. I can never say the B-I-T-C-H word. But I can say that that person is being a fool. You know, they're being foolish, you know. They, they're just enjoying, you know, because they're feeling happy. Their work has paid off. They're going through themselves to do some um, emotional discovery. Just even going through their past uh, traumas to just reconnect with them. Just some, some energy of reconciliation in terms of... Um, you keeping to yourself you know you've been keeping to yourself like connections around you you don't even have to put up a fight people will come coming to you people will come looking for you there is no reason for you to just there will be yourself enjoy yourself enjoy this energy this glow you're having you know the fool i really feel like the cup this fool i feel like is the capricorn's best card to show up why because it comes after us working on shit after us working putting in effort and we're ruled by Saturn you know we always change it so when these new beginnings come in that let us be loose come on fam you tell me you're not gonna enjoy that with your death card something uh, something you might have thought it was over with uh, death card with the knight of cups probably a love situation you move towards you probably thought uh, oh well it's, it's not gonna work out well think again that shit is coming back to life but with the judgment in reverse, I really think there's some work that needs to be done. There is, um, yeah, what is the judgment in reverse? I keep getting this. Okay, 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 okay. Oh. <laughs> uh, for the judgment in reverse, you get the Empress, the Ace of Cups, and the Tower. Uh, you get this energy of uh, you or your person. I get your person. Because you, I see you as a knight of cups and the fool. You know, you're being playful, you're being goofy, you're ready for love, you're moving towards love. But I think you, this, the situation is not ready to be resurrected again. You know, even though the death card is in reverse, it seems like maybe a person hasn't completely walked away. They still have memories of you. They still have love for you. They want to offer you this love. It's like, are you patient enough to accept this love? You know, because I really feel like we're stepping into our loving energy. Um, consciousness, right? Just love and the uh, emotions around us, you know. Just uh, feeling, feeling things, you know. Uh, letting our cups overflow. I feel like this person wants to come in, and uh, but they're just doing some healing, uh, some uh, self discovery, some. Uh, they're working on themselves. That's the best way I can put it. You know, they're enjoying what they have. They're enjoying their kingdom. Just they're in this empress energy, motherhood. You know nurturing what they have around them so really it's like would you this, this don't you know don't disrupt this person's peace don't go out of your way to just be like hey what's up just let them be let them sit down i feel like they know you love them they know you have this connection with them empress to the emperor you know they they know this they know this it's just like because the empress is a three you might say something or just push them to do something and it might make, cause them to rush into making a decision because with the empress they got options they got things around them but they want you and they are kind of getting prepared to come your way they're kind of getting prepared to really shine through for you right now you okay if you're dealing with some competition if you're dealing with some competition Go towards it. Make your move. Uh, with um, you get the nine of pentacles, abundance and knowledge around you, and you have the seven of wands. You know, you you yourself, you are special. Remember when I told you you are yellow? In this situation, you feel like you're competing. Your whole self is yellow. You glowing yellow. You feel special. You feel like you're the light. 
you feel like you are meant to do this and you are you truly are you know this connection is like you your person okay now i see why the judgment is reversed it's not ready to be resurrected because your person is just sitting and enjoying their happiness enjoying what they have around them and just admiring probably you admiring you from a distance you see what i mean look at these people they're both admiring each other from a distance and that's fine give your person some space enjoy your kingdom enjoy let them enjoy their peace you know because there is a love opportunity coming your way believe it or not this person will come your way just chill the fuck out however when they yeah when they come your way it might be a fuss it might be a huge fuss because um with the death card i also think you guys have unfinished business to handle the tower is here you guys have some uh, shit to go through uh, ha, ha, ha. but the tower is changed capricorn we're used to this it's um you will be going through some changes some realization some um you know some troublesome moments going through your own shit your own time but this is just to bringing you to bring you to that emotional fulfillment queen of queen of swords and the ten of cups you're really gonna feel a burden with this person on the level of this person fits you, this person suits you, this person loves you, this person really gets you. Queen of Swords. Queen of Swords. You might be a bit defensive moving forward, letting this person in. Uh, you might be having a lot of people coming your way. Because um, even with the Ten of uh, Cups, I get this energy of you and your partner enjoying your emotions, you know, enjoying what you have around. But there is still this ten of cups up. The, you know, this, there is these options around them. Remember when? Uh, oh wow, the hermit. Uh, yeah, you might. There is a there is a light that needs to be shine. There is a light that needs to be shown on this situation. And with the hangman sideways, it's like you or your person can be fine without each other. It's just like sometimes you miss each other. And uh, yeah, with this ten of cups. You know, there is emotional happiness, friends, you know, you might want to spend some time with a, a friend, uh, yeah, lovers, it's a, it's a beautiful day, it's a beautiful day for you, this is what I'm telling you, you have the tower, the, the six of wands, the lovers, the six of swords, there is this release, there is this, no my god, six, six, Six. I've been saying this shit the whole fucking day, and I'm not even tripping balls, bro. I've been saying this all day. Six, six, six. Something is coming to a completion. Something is just being divinely guided, divinely sent to you. The way things have been unfolding is so that it can bring you guys together. It's so that it can really, really, really bring you guys together. I don't even know how I can put those words in the best way possible. You know. You might have needed to spend some time with you, your friends, and people around you who care about you on the level of we share the same ideas to gain more insight. And that's gonna make your mind, sp mind space move to a better karma situation. You're no longer worried about shit. All you're worried about is you connecting with your loved one. See what I'm saying? There's this energy of everything you've been going through has been guided just to make you better and make you, uh, make you a diamond. You know, make you a fucking diamond. You know why I said a fucking diamond? People love diamonds, but they don't know what kind of pressure they've been through. The kind of hardships. And right now, as a knight of wands, I really, really see you as that um, diamond, you know. It's just that you have to go through your own pressures, your own troubles. Yeah.